Why, hello, you guys. Crazy Bomber Duke in here with another Let's Play of Pokemon Fire Red. In the last episode, we have made through Mount, we have entered Mount Moon, and we're trying to get out of Mount Moon. And we also got a temporary um, Pokemon member into the team, only for HM um, using, which is a Paris. And Duke Club is in Duke Club, and my IV store is still with me as it got it's gotten stronger from the last episode. Thank goodness that Duke could learn Pound. Excuse me. Ugh, I just want to say sorry, guys. Throughout the time, I've been trying to get the recordings to work. The recordings has been pissing me off because the freaking uh, microphone's been acting weird, kind of funky. I don't know what it is. But regardless of that, I'm just glad I'm finally able to talk. And you guys can hear me loud and clear. Oh, yeah. Anyway, we're going to face this Team Rocket Grunt. Little kids shouldn't be messing around with grown-ups. It could be bad news. Oh, what the heck you're doing? That's causing a lot of trouble. And we have to stop you. Duh. And Rotata. You got level 15 Rotata. Oh, Kosaka. Oh, my God. What, what is with these critical hits, man? Oh, my God. I hate it. I hate it every time. Every freaking time I fight a certain trainer, it's always got to be with critical hits I'm getting hit with. Anyway, I'm gonna go for mine. I gotta be careful because I'm almost running out of mine. Level 20. Okay, my IV sword is growing too much on too many levels. It's way too high. Um, sand shroom. Um, Alright, you know what? Uh, I'll bite, I'll bite, I'll bite. Alright, my sand shroom is down. Alright, I can't use any more of those vine ones because. Steams. Yes, you are. And you give us 416 Pokedolls. Thank you so much. You're too kind. Anyway, oh my god. Oh, what now? No, Zubat. Goodbye. As a matter of fact, you know what? Let me use that potion. Because I only, I only have one potion left, but I was going to use it for later on because, oh boy, we got another. Oh. There we go. We should find a rare Clefairy here. No, we found a Paris, but hey, you know what? Actually, I know this may sound crazy, guys. Trust me, but I want to catch this. I want to catch another Paris because there's a. Remember, what I told you guys in the last episode that there's a five percent chance. There's a five percent chance that this Paris is gonna be a pain in my ass. And I just used the last of my um, potions. Just, just, that's just great. Uh, well, luckily I got a. I don't want to waste. I honestly don't want to waste. Waste and revive. I really don't want to do that. That's just a rare thing to find. And you know, getting a revive, buying revive is going to be like after you get your third or fourth batch. But I want to see if I get lucky if I find a. Um, Ooh, let's we'll see what item is this one. Oh! Dude! That is so awesome! Holy crap! I, like I said, a 5% chance of getting those! A big mushroom! That is so awesome! Finally! Oh my god, I found this Pokemon! Jeez, I don't know how long it took, but jeez, I finally found it. Um, I'm going to put it to sleep, then go for tackle. Oh man, it took so much chaos to find a fairy. Oh man, <laughs> oh my god, oh, you just. Oh no, don't wait. I can't put me to sleep. I'm paralyzed. Oh! Okay, fine. I'll, I'm fine, 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 fine. I'll do it. I'll do it. I'll do it. I'll do it. I'm probably gonna hate myself in the morning. Great! Now I can't. 
God, thank you. Oh my God, help me. No, I am paralyzed. Do you not listen to me? No! Okay, guys. After going through back and forth, and everything else, and end up getting paralyzed again by that damn Paris. We have got some po. I came. I finally got my Pokemon healed, and I got some new. I got some Pokemon. Oh, but I got my I so paralyzed. And I said again. Oh, I hate that darn Paris. I only I only caught it because I won. I need an HM slave. Second of all, I totally. Need a freaking what is it? Uh, I also want to get those rare items. And by the way, speaking of that, um, not only the big mushroom, I found, I found, I caught two, uh, two more of Paris, and they got tiny mushrooms. So I'm gonna sell those. But I'm gonna try and catch this very. And no, guys, I, I appreciate sure you guys my axe. Am I gonna add um very in my team? Um, the answer will be, will be oh, sorry. <clears throat> the answer to that will be no. I actually don't want to add Clefairy to my team. Stand Clefairy, because Clefairy is too darn popular. popular. I'm not a fairy. I'm not. A, I'm not a Clefairy person. I'm a Jigglypuff fan. But now that we caught one, it's awesome because Clefairy is, as the Pokédex explained, is a rare Pokémon. All right, so we gotta fight this Rocky Grunt. Revive a Pokemon from from the fossils will earn us huge riches. Selling Pokemon to make money is just so damn selfish and evil. I'm sorry, but that's exactly how I feel. Anyway, we're gonna go against this Rattata. I'm going for your quick attack. Right there, I'm paralyzed. Ay, 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 ay. Hyper Fang! Oh my god. That is the signature move of um, Radata and his evolve from Eradicate, but later in generations of other Pokemon can learn that. And now the next Pokemon is Zubat. I am actually going to switch to Jimmy. Alright, so we are going to Zubat. Leech life. That's all you gotta say is leech life. <laughs> anyway, let's go for pound. Let's see how much it is. Not doing that much damage. Oh god, please not supersonic anything but that. Oh my god, I hate that move so bad. So bad. Anyway, let's see how. Uh, leech life. I can't believe in seven in seventh gen that leech life got a massive buff. It went from twenty to eighty in generation seven. That is just, that's just crazy right there. But anyway, our cube charm activated. Nice job, Bulbrain. That takes care of the Zubat. And you love is not going to love again. Oh, now I'm mad. Too bad, so sad. Anyway, so we take care of you. And if we go over here, I'm sorry. If we go over here, that's no, another Moonstone. So we can evolve our Jigglypuff and Clefairy. Should I do that with Clefairy? Nah. Right is one more step to get to him. Really? One step! Let me just finish this too. Oh my god, one step! One step! Thank god, man. Hey, I found these fossils. They're both mine. Super Nerd Miguel, or my name in the Spanish version, likes the battle. Okay, um, you know what? I'm gonna steal some HP from you. Why not? Never 
mind. Ah. I'm just gonna go for tackle. And you just go for power. I'm just gonna go for tackle again. Come on, 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 come on. Come on. Give me a best shot. And I oh you jerk in the chain. Anyway, that goes a freaking grinder. And then it's going for coughing. Oh boy, this is gonna be tough because now that my tackle is. Oh, never mind. <laughs> okay, that's actually good. Because coughing is um very defensive and with the ability to levitate, ground type moves can do nothing to it. Uh, we won't be seeing coughing until later on in the game. I just want to say coughing is really accurate. Physical with Coughing's good offensive. Oh, well, uh, it's decent offense. I'm not gonna say it's good, it's decent. It's, it's defense is off the charts. So I'm gonna give that. All right, we go level 22. Oh my god! Already we learned Razor Leaf. Um, okay. Uh, I can't have all grass type moves. I need to keep at least a normal type. Um. Wow. I. You know what? I'll get rid of Fine Blade because we don't need that. Man, we really buffed. Uh, really got our. Uh, our Ivy Sword way too strong. That's too much. That's way too much. And it's going for skills. It's too much. Okay, I'll share. Good. We'll each take a fossil. No, no being greedy. Okay. The dome fossil or the helix fossil. The dome fossil will become uh, a Kabuto, and the helix fossil will become Omanite. Both Pokemon are good, and they have one. There's a there's a certain change you get. Uh, one with they both have um two um two abilities. One of them. Is basically they protect from critical hits, and the other one is Swift Swim. Um, I have another game. I have another game card. I have a Leaf Green, and that one has the Helix Fossil. So for this one, I'm gonna get the Dome Fossil because I want to do. Um, maybe if there's a possible thing I'm gonna do later on at the end of the game, I'm gonna collect all the Pokemon and I'm gonna get 100. Um, complete the Pokedex. I'm. I might. I'm not gonna keep my promises on that. I might do that. Oh my god, of that! <sighs> Not trying to raise my voice. Not trying to raise my voice. I just. Don't you just hate it when you get one step before you're about to leave or meet someone and just get an encounter? I hate when it happens. Now, we come to here, you guys. Right here, we talk to these two guys. They are actually mood tutors. They will teach you one move from each one. I believe this guy right here is going to teach you um, this pack of destructive power. With the church on down, Mega Punch is the ultimate attack. Don't yet you agree? Yes. Now let me teach your Pokemon. Let me teach it to your Pokemon. He's going. This guy is going to teach you Mega Punch, and the other person is going to teach you Mega Kick. And it's only learn once. So let's see. I I knew I know Jigglypuff can learn Mega Punch and Mega Kick, so I'm going to teach it Mega Punch. Now we're comrades in the way of punching. You should go. You should go before you see the misguided fool trains only. It's only sick, silly kicking over there. And yeah, talk to him. He'll talk about um, mega kick. I I am actually not gonna teach none of my Pokemon mega kick. I'm actually gonna hold him on for later on because it is a Pokemon I'm actually gonna add to my team that I wanna have it learn mega kick. Because let me tell you something. Um, Mega Punch, Mega Kick is way stronger than Mega Punch. Way stronger than Mega Punch. So I would totally like to keep. I would totally like to learn Mega Kick, but I gotta keep it. Anyway, oh boy! After all that craziness and me talking so much, we 
finally, and I mean finally, we have made it to Cerulean City. Oh, hallelujah. Let's heal up our Pokemon. Oh, man, after all that craziness. Ugh, that's a pain. So let me let me go with play oh uh, let me replace these guys in the PC and we're good. Oh boy. Oh man, I can't believe how crazy that is. Alright, so let's see here. Now we can get, there's um a few new Pokemon here. You can get Ekans and you can get Sandshrew. Um I do believe Ekans is, is exclusive only to Fire Red. Um, <laughs> All right, now let's. I want to show you guys something. You come up here. There's a hidden item from the back of this house. You go right here, and you got a rare candy. Just like that. Done like dinner. And if you talk to this guy right here, he'll actually tell you about the badges. And if you have at least one, he'll tell you the secrets about it. And since we got the boulder badge, we already know. Let's, you know what? Let's just for this one. We're going to talk about the boulder badge. The attack stat of all your Pokemon increases a little bit. It also lets you use the move Flash outside of battle. I could go for the other ones, but I don't want to be like that. Too much. Anyway. So, we pretty much got everything good right here. Um, in the next episode, we're going to go and tack on the Nugget Bridge. And possibly might get a new Pokemon. Maybe. But until then, you guys. Crazy Bomber Duke here. And I will see you guys then.